Hey guys, um, 3D Vista has released a new update and I think it's pretty nice. It's not as nice as what I think we're all expecting, like the new hotspot editor. I have no idea what it's gonna be, but it's gonna be good and we still have to wait. But until that time, 3D Vista has released now um, a new update in which it is enable 3D Vista Cloud Analytics. Um, and I think it's pretty nice. Um, so how it works is you just uh, publish and you just click on uh, here like well when you're logged in and you enable you check this box enable 3d vista cloud and next publish and that's it and then you can just log into your cloud and do all the analytics and stuff like that i'm not gonna dive too much into that because there's just a tutorial about that from 3d vista about that so uh, there you can uh, learn all about that um, other things they have released, uh, so the, the 3D Vista Cloud Analytics, what's, I think the key points about it is that the report is really simple and easy to use. And secondly, there's heat maps. You can really see what people were watching. So that is uh, pretty nice. Um, uh, I really hope they will also uh, do this for like external hosting services. That would be really nice. But so far, you know, this is how it is. But they also added another thing, the cookie policy. And I think this is a pretty big thing because, um, well, uh, a lot of people, uh, virtual tour creators has, were wondering like, hey, I'm adding Google Analytics to my virtual tour um, with some uh, analytics ID and stuff like that. But how do I get this really compliant, you know, and um, GDPR and, and stuff like that. So um, it's really nice to see that they just added this cookies policy in the publish playlist tab. So how it works is um, you just click add and you search for your URL and you select a country. So I think, I think it's supposed to be like this. I might be wrong about that. So double check with your lawyers and <laughs> stuff like that. So now you might be wondering, okay, so how do I get like a cookie policy uh, up and running? And I did a little bit of research and luckily there are cookie policy generators. So I just clicked the first one on Google and I uh, said this and I'm not sure which ones are like doable. So please check this yourself and with your lawyer, <laughs> I'm just going to do something like site preferences. I'm not sure if it's correct. Um, Google Analytics, that for sure. Um, and and behavioral advertising, I think when you're using heat maps, that is probably something you should do. Um, and for the rest, yeah, double check that with <laughs> other professionals. Um, and then users can contact me regarding my use of cookies uh, by email, visiting a link on our website or by phone. So I'm going to say by email, I'm going to say Ronald at 360creators.com and I say next. Okay, my website name is 360 creators, 360creators.com. And then what I do is I generate my cookies policy and it's right over there. And I can just take this link and I can go to 3D Vista and I just copy that in there, copy and paste it, paste it in there. And then I just say done and I publish this and boom. So as you can see, um, now, uh, as I uh, added this cookie policy, it shows that here uh, this uh, web page uh, uses cookies uh, for statistics. Uh, check the cookie policy for more info. And I will just check the language of your browser or like IP address. I think it's based on IP address. So it shows for me in Dutch. And when I click on cookie policy, it opens the same URL. And I think this is still a little bug, uh, but I've also tested this in, in incognito and then it just works nicely. So for some reason it has to do with like working on your own device. I also tested it on my other devices and there it's working fine. So when I'm watching in incognito, it just opens the actual URL. So that, um, I think it's really nice. Uh, you can uh, accept them or refuse them. Um, so let's just accept that. And I'm GDPR compliant as a creator. So, well, that's good news. 
Now let's check out the other updates that are there. Um, there is 8K uh, video resolution support in the publication. Uh, so this is the 8K version. Then going to hotspots, it still says this thing. So you would think, huh, you support 8K 360 video, right? Yeah, but mm, it's still showing up this. Uh, I contacted Freddy Vista about this and they said that they will fix this uh, after the hotspot editor, the magical hotspot editor. So waiting for that. But the publishing, so when you publish this, it will uh, show up in 8K.